great white shark. Focus. Power. Purpose. Seals are their usual prey of choice. But what about something bigger? Much bigger. South Africa's coast is shark infested. Massive tigers. Marauding bulls. And gangs of black tips. They're all here. It's a predator's playground. Roughly two million seals live at the southern tip of Africa, which is why one of the highest concentrations of great whites on the planet hunt these waters. Other giants are here too. It's the beginning of winter in the southern hemisphere. Great pods of humpback whales like this are heading north. For four months, they fed on nutritious krill off Antarctica, building up blubber reserves for this journey. Over 30,000 humpbacks make this annual migration. Their destination, Mozambique, to give birth to their calves in warm tropical waters. The ocean off southern Africa is too cold for baby whales. It's dangerous, too. Great white sharks dominate these southern waters. The humpback migration routes take them right through white shark territory. So what happens when humpback whales and white sharks run into each other? Wow. Away from the boat, away from the boat, away from the boat. There we go. Ryan Johnson is a shark scientist based in Mossel Bay, South Africa. He's been studying the white shark population here for over 20 years. Whoa, there we go. Oh, she went for it. February 2017, he was flying his drone during a shark survey when the phone rang. The phone call came in from the National Sea Rescue Institute that they had been alerted that there was a whale out at sea. It looked like it had been wrapped up in long line. The whale wasn't moving. Was it dead? And the whale breathed and it blew. And I realized this whale is still alive. Then Ryan saw something else. A 14 foot great white shark headed straight for the young whale. did the unexpected. It attacked. I 
I know the science and I know the literature and I know this has never been seen before.